Well, hello everyone. Yeah, it's me again. Um, it's just a uh, bit of a chin wag, uh, just a bit of a response really to uh, some recent videos that I've been doing about Hulking Cemetery or, or really any video that's, you know, a paranormal investigation video or just uh, visiting haunted locations um, and reiterating what Paul says, Paul's one of his re recent vlogs about, you know, the paranormal and all this and hauntings and that. It's like uh, politics and religion or something like that. You know, it's uh, you're either into it, you sort of half believe it, or you just don't want to know, <laughs> you know. Um, you know, a lot of people... Uh, if you're into it, like I am, you know, I'm a sensitive and, uh, you know, sensitive to paranormal and whatever. You know, I'm I'm well into it. I'm actually well into it. You know, I'll watch a video and think, oh, yes, you know, or I'll watch a video and I'll think, oh, yeah, there's something going on here. But some people, you know, you can show them a video of an, an apparition standing there or walking through a wall or whatever and they just... Do not want to know they'll say ah a load of crap fake you know and all this lot well it's fair enough you know they're not into it that's fair enough but a lot of people you know the ones that they they just do not like or they're not into it they'll click on a video you know ghost hunting or apparition or whatever what why watch the bloody videos if you're not into it and then moan you know yeah just being just a response to some some recent comments on my Hulkin. Um, like I say, I'm sensitive, especially when I go to Hulkin. Tell you what, as soon as I walk through the gates, I start feet warming up, I feel pressure, in my chest, and the last time I visited, I got all that and a headache and all sorts of going on. You know, one or two have commented saying, "Well, if they had them experiences, they'd be from there." But I've been. <laughs> witnessing and experience things since I was a child you do you you sort of get used to it you know if I felt that I was going to faint or collapse or something like that then I would I'd get from that location I was quick as I can quick as I could you know I'd just get from there like and uh, you know but yeah I get all these emotions these, uh, I was holding the ERD meter my hand was shaking the other one um, if you look, if you watch the video, you'll see the other hand holding the camera. The camera's perfectly still, and yet my hand that's holding the ERD meter is like that, shaking. You know, if, why just the the hand holding e the ERD meter? Why not, you know, the hand holding the camera? Because it'd be like that, but it wasn't. If you look, if you look, you know, if you've seen the the video, like you'll you'll see the camera's perfectly still, and yet my hand I can hardly hold it. That's, that's just how that place affects me. Um, you know, someone... Uh, I, I, I've had one or two comments saying, I'm not convinced. Well, <laughs> firstly, I'm not trying to convince anyone. You know, like I said, people believe it, people half believe it, or people don't want to know. I just go to these places, I document what I feel, my emotions, I document, if, if I capture anything on camera, if I don't capture anything on camera, you just do not know. But there's one thing I'm not, I never have done, is try to convince people. I don't, I don't go to these places and if I ca captured an apparition, I'll say, oh, that's a ghost. You've got to believe it's a ghost. Ram it down your throat. I, I, I do not try and convince people. I just document it, put it out on YouTube. People can watch it, comment, think what they want. You know, if they think, oh yeah, there's something going on there, or it's a load of crap. It's fair enough, but I'm not trying to convince anyone. And I've had another comment saying, oh, not a single ghost was seen. You know, I, I, I think that was on that, like a when I just wandered around, I didn't say anything. There again, you know, I've explained this. Some people can watch a video 
and then catch something that other people can't. Which my mate Paul, I tell you what, he'd see a black cat in a in a dark cellar. Um, he's it's happened loads of times, not just with Paul, but other people on this latest um, uh, Holkin visit. Um, I've got loads of messages, private messages, where they've seen some, something I've missed and something that Paul's missed. Oh, is that something? They've given me the times, the still to look at, and I, I actually haven't got round to it yet. They say they've seen a, a figure, is it a gravestone? Oh, it looks like a dark figure, and they've given me all these times. There must be about half a dozen that I've got to check out I, you know, on this, this recent visit. Um, but yeah, like I say, you know, I can film something and, and look at it till the bloody cows come home and someone will, will look at it, you know, and they'll say straight away, hang on, what's that there? And then you look and you think, bloody hell, yeah, I've missed that. You know, it's, that's, how, that's how it goes. That's how it goes. Some people can see, or oh, but they'll catch something that someone else can't. So anyway, yeah, I've got a few things to check out. Figures and, and something on my right shoulder, left shoulder, and that there's things behind me. So I'll have to check them out. And yes, like I said, you know, it's a paranormal, the ghost hunting and whatever. If, you, if you're into it, because I've actually experienced the amount of stuff that I've experienced. I can... I. I cannot turn around and say, ah, oh, it's a load of crap. There's definitely something going on. There's definitely something there. And especially with that um, Hulking Cemetery. As soon as I walk in that place, it's it's another world. Like I said, the first thing, my hate, face heats up. I can pressure it in my chest. I can feel my pulse rising. And this last visit, I got a headache. And, you know, one hand was shaking, holding the meter. Yet the other hand was like it isn't holding this camera perfectly still. So, you know, and that's hulking. And I can go to, take for instance, other haunted locations such as the mental hospital. I mean, the morgue in a mental hospital. You know, the old ruined morgue. I mean, if there's anywhere going to be haunted, it's going to be that place. I've been in that morgue loads of times. Nothing. Not felt nothing at all. You know, so, and the chapel. I've captured orbs, and I've captured orbs inside and outside the chapel. Uh, I go inside the chapel, nothing. Absolutely nothing at all. I'm perfect. No heating up, no pressure on my chest, nothing. And I can go to somewhere else things you know like start experiencing things so but yeah like I say you know it's uh that's one thing I'm not trying to do is convince anyone so yeah anyway I'll see you in the next one